A lawmaker is accusing a state attorney of breaking the rules when he offered legal advice to Senate Democrats who fled the state back in February. The night team's David Douglas has that story. It is new at 10, David. It's all about this email here, right okay. here, Maria, from an assistant attorney general. It warns two of those 14 Senate Democrats who fled the state to stay out of Wisconsin border counties in Illinois, saying law enforcement may still have jurisdiction there. It's pretty shocking, quite frankly. When Senate Democrats left the state, many people offered them advice, but Representative Steve Noss says yeah, the list shouldn't have included a state attorney. Because he clearly indicates his support for the Democrat senators who fled to Illinois and their desire to derail the budget repair bill. The email was sent by Thomas Belavia. The first line indicates his support, and even though it came from his personal email account, Noss says his actions are a violation of the state's attorney client privilege. It still is wrong. It would be no different than a doctor on a weekend writing an email to me about any medical condition you have. The Whitewater Republican believes since Bolivia is one of two assistant attorneys general who helped pen the state's open meetings compliance guide, he has knowledge to stand in the way of the state's lawsuit against the collective bargaining portions of the budget repair bill. If I have the timeline right, uh, the uh, attorney general's office was not defending the law because it hadn't passed at that particular point in time. And the Department of Justice seems to side with Senator Erpenbach, not Nas. In a statement, its executive assistant said, quote, anyone following the litigation over the budget repair bill will quickly recognize the absurdity of NASA's suggestion that DOJ is not vigorously defending the legislature's lawmaking. If I have a constituent who wants to contact me, whether they work for the state or don't, from their home computer, they should feel free to do so. In an email to me tonight, Valavia says his only comment about this is his note was his personal views on his own time. He sent the email to the senators on a Sunday. And David, what about the Department of Justice? What are they saying? Well, they're really siding with him on this, saying this was on personal time. Noss does say he'll ask the governor to hire a private legal team since he doesn't believe DOJ is acting fully in the state's best interest. The spokesperson in the governor's office said tonight that Governor Walker is focused on creating 250,000 jobs in Wisconsin. And based on that, I think we can assume they're probably not interested in doing that. All right. News 3's David Douglas reporting tonight. David, thank you very much.